So we wanted to do a little video explaining things we did to the RV. And so this whole little shelf unit we put in, I say we, like I had anything to do with it. Um, this was just space here. This is behind the blue. That's the dinette behind it. So Mr. Rogue put this little shelving unit in, used the back of the dinette, and we put these little tension rods in. So it holds all the things, like right by the door, you know, your shoes, the bug spray, you know, my books that I brought up here. And right on the top, when you first walk in, these little bud vases I bought, how cute, right? These little white ones. And um, this is like a catch-all here, this little tray and my little Buddha hands. You know, you're always looking for things to put down, but where to put things down. I'm gonna turn off the... So loud, so loud. Now we understand why people always say, I don't like the AC. They always go, oh, I don't like the AC. And we're like camping, like, what do you mean you don't like the AC? Now we, it's so loud. Now we understand why people are like. So this bed was a Murphy bed. So in the middle between these two cabinets, it flipped up and half of it went into the storage, which would be underneath here. And so it flipped up here and there was a couch here that was sort of unusable. And I hated the fact that the bed, half of the bed went into the storage. You know, the mattress went sort of underneath there. So I wanted it to be permanent. I wanted to seal it up. I wanted to put the bed here permanently. Mr. Rogue made this, um, you know, I'm a shrimp. So Mr. Rogue made these little stairs and that drawer and this little, you know, a lot of it's not finished. This flips up. So there's storage underneath and then there's this drawer. This is just for looks at the moment. <laughs> we haven't actually gotten to that yet. And I wanna antique this. Um, reading the leaves by my friends. <laughs> it's my nighttime reading. <laughs> so tons of storage, 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 right? Like I designed it in case you were living in it. Like that was the way we designed it. So then the next bit of fun is the eight foot countertop, right? That's fun. And we painted all the blue, 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 blue. We were sort of sick of Admiral Blue, but now that it's all done, love. Mr. Rogue, do you want to get in? No. Okay. Um... So all the white, I want to antique. See the white on that shelf? I'm going to use an antiquing gel. The white here, I'm going to use an antiquing gel. So it's not so white coming out of there, you know? Here, I may do it too on these tiles. The cutout of this fits back in here to make them the counter all the way down. Oh, I walked in here with my shoes. I covered these. They were some hideous brown leather. We left those actually. Um, these, these were original. This we, I have to antique, obviously. And then our plan is to hang mason jars under here for storage and I bought them for under here is the spice that magnetic spices will go under there we just need to get metal for for that so that's the reno <laughs> we still have some things to do some again like little finishing touches but you know Here's the storage. This is all storage under here, you know. And then this is all storage under here. You know, it's super cute, right? All right, kids. 
So that's the final, the walkthrough of all of the goings on. <laughs> it's taken a while. Yeah, the sink too. I mean, Mr. Rogue, he did a beautiful job on this. We're gonna oil this now before we go. You know, you can still see it's wet. We were trying not to use it so much. We really wanna put the oil on this to preserve it. This bucket, if you're a camper, is the best thing ever because I wash everything in here so that none of the um, food goes down into the RV. So you use this first and then I dump that outside. Well, our first trip, she did good. I'm gonna go help Mr. Rogue pack now. All right, kids, thanks.